What's up guys? We are here with another awesome project car. About a week ago, I traded my Hilux Surf for a pretty wicked car. I definitely had to trade up and yeah, so this vlog is dedicated to showing you guys the new car. All right, so for the most part, um, the car is completely how we got it from the owner. Um, the only thing different is when we first traded it, it was rear wheel drive and then we put the front CV axle shafts in. So now it's all wheel drive again. I guess I shouldn't be calling it a car because it's technically a wagon. But without further ado, meet Doris. As you may have seen on Instagram, this is our new car, Doris. It's a 99 Nissan Stagia. It was already previously imported by the previous owner. And then they did a straight trade for my Hilux Surf. As for engine wise, it's still the stock RB25 DET. It sounds really good. Um, yeah, it's all stock though pretty well. shocks instead of the hood prop. Yeah, the previous owner painted it purple, like the valve cover purple, and yeah, the paint's completely meant though as he was like a body guy. Uh, he even did some rust repair, so there's no rust strut towers. Yeah, pretty cool overall for a winter car. Um, show you guys the interior. Even has a special fob. Alright, so came with energy steering wheel, um, quick release. Also came with the confetti Recaro. And other than that, it's stock. I put my weighted shift knob in. That's about the only difference. But yeah, so I just thought I'd show you guys the new Stagia, my new winter car. Um, we have a few plans for it and I'm planning on keeping it for a while for sure. So maybe those of you who follow and subscribe to me from America, maybe you guys can buy it off me in eight years. <laughs> it's eight years? Yeah, I don't know. But yeah. Oh, also I made my little, uh, my own little, what do you call it, mirror hanger. Mirror hanger? I don't know. But uh, yeah, I found this in the glove box. And I thought it'd be cool if I attached it to one of those elastic air freshener pieces. There you go. I thought it was kind of cool. So it's just one of the air freshener strings. <laughs> um, it's an RS4S. So it has little gauges on it and it is manual. And yeah. Little area for your change. And all of your other knickknacks that the family wagon would need. Sorry, the back's kind of messy. So we've been dailying it. There's surprisingly not too much room in the back. Like for a wagon, there's not much room at all. Oh. Casually peep. The so scare. Suck my ass sticker. You guys can go check out So Scare on Instagram. Yes suck my ass figures and they're pretty dope. The back's pretty simple. Oh, it also came with an extra old gold turbo. Yeah, came with an extra little gold turbo and a stock steering wheel. But I'm gonna stick with the energy steering wheel for now. As well as, has this hard, the hard privacy cover. I don't know where this hooks. Oh. Oh. Got it. Oh, as well as... I don't know if you can put stuff up on here into the netting, but I know it also folds down and connects to here. So you have little... I guess if you have a dog in the back or something. I don't know, it's pretty cool though. Put that back. But yeah, this is it. Yeah, so about a week ago, Colton and I drove an hour and a half, as well as the previous owner of the Stagia. He drove, I think it was almost two hours, and we met kind of in the middle. And 
and yeah, it was just a straight deal, super easy. We were all mechanics, so we all had all our papers filled out. It was all done in like within half an hour and drove the cars home. So it was super duper simple. I almost forgot. I can't believe I almost forgot this. I will start it up for you guys and hopefully you'll be able to hear the exhaust because it's pretty loud. I think it's just like pretty much straight pipe, no cat or anything. Um, yeah, here we go. anything that I missed on this our new Stagia project let me know and I'll do my best to add whatever I missed into the next vlog. As for plans for the Stagia I'm thinking we'll probably I don't know I honestly don't know definitely some wheels for it other than that um, Colton and I are in the process of creating a website with a bunch of merch and like custom interior pieces so we'll probably dress it up with some interior pieces lower it kind of stance it a bit probably we'll probably stance it at least for summer we're definitely it's gonna be a show car for summer and then gonna be my winter car for winter so I'm excited to see what happens with it and we'll try to make it really cool as for the s15 I promise I will make vlogs as soon as I can for it I just there's nothing to vlog about it right now other than that, this was just a quick vlog to show you guys the new project and look forward to the next one.